strength awaits as time unfolds. No one knows quite what a future holds. Bonjour mes amis, hi guys, guten tag. Uh, today we immerse into the fascinating world of Johann Benzinger who is famous for his uh, hand uh, guilloche work which he applied to other industries than, uh, than watches, uh, automotive industry for example. Uh, he's also famous for his engraving, the skeletonization of the movement and it's all very low production, each piece being unique. You can discover the many projects on the website, contact the brand uh, directly and ask for your own customization, whether it be a rotor, a whole movement, a case or a whole watch, anything is possible. But our focus now is the Gap 1 featuring for the first time the brand's own movement developed by the respected Austrian Habring. Does the name German-Austrian partnership GAP GAP 1. The decoration is all in-house, of course, the dial is in the tradition of Breguet and certainly will remind you of the late great George Daniels' work. The depth of the extravagant movement decoration is quite breathtaking. If you are in uh, Hong Kong, China or in this neck of the woods and are interested uh, by one of these watches, uh, please check out the description for contact details of a passionate authorized dealer in Hong Kong who lent me these watches for review. The white dial version is already sold, the salmon dial is still available, but you can order something else uh, through Benjamin. Now some specs while you enjoy, I hope, the video. The dial is uh, made of sterling silver, hand gear shade, rose gold, uh, plated for the salmon version and uh, there are different co colors of course that you, you can get. Uh, the hour and minute indication is slightly shifted towards the 12 o'clock as you will notice and the uh, sub dials for small seconds and date indication have a uh, different plating depending on the, the color. Uh, the salmon dial here has a rhodium plating for example. Uh, the uh, ground plate will be plated with a black rhodium, a hand gear shade, rose gold and rhodium plating for the movement parts flame blued crown and ratchet wheel, flamed blued uh, screws, uh, the, the movement uh, has a shifted hour and minute indication as I mentioned, it's a hand wound movement with the small seconds at 8 and the date indication at 4 o'clock, uh, diameter is 30 millimeters, height of 5.1 millimeter, it's a 4 hertz movement, 48 hours of uh, power reserve with a tangential uh, screw fine regulation, a Carl Haas sprung balance in chronometer accuracy, Kif shock absorbers and 19 joules. Uh, as you can see the hands have been uh, heat blued and they are in the Breguet uh, style. If you purchase the watch you will get an alligator or leather strap uh, with a folding clasp and screwed in uh, strap lugs uh, which is uh, pretty uh, practical. And for the case, uh, quite interesting, it's a high-grade uh, steel case made by uh, Forchheim, <laughs> optionally uh, with a 3D engraving if you want to customize a bit more. Uh, the crown is at 2 o'clock, as you can see, the pusher for the date correction at the tree, protected by uh, crown guards, which is a, a nice touch. Um, doesn't make it easier to push the button, uh, but at, at least uh, you're not going to do it accidentally. Uh, the diameter is 39 mm, the height is 11.5 to be precise and you have sapphire glass of course on both sides. So uh, there you go, tell me a bit uh, what you think and um, if you remember I showed you my uh, recently acquired Garrick uh, S5 which is also with an in-house movement made by Ad Garrick uh, actually uh, quite a bit uh, thinner and uh, has a very deep uh, guilloche on the on the dial 
but the, the dial uh, layout uh, also uh, reminiscent of what uh, George Daniels uh, was doing. Uh, very different uh, look on the in terms of the, the case, uh, and of course in terms of the movement, so the, the Garrick is uh, pretty uh, pretty simple, uh, which uh, which I like, uh, while the uh, movement from a uh, Benzinger is uh, quite extravagant. So let me know a bit uh, which one you you prefer, but I will tell you this: the uh, price point of the Benzinger. Uh, especially uh, here with uh, a movement developed by Habring is uh, really excellent at uh, I think 12,900 euros quite a bit less than the uh, Garrick and um, yeah you get a really uh, exceptional exceptional watch so uh, check them out check out the description for uh, contact here in, uh, in Hong Kong in case you're interested to uh, purchase or order one of these uh, watches and uh, looking forward to your comments thanks for watching guys uh, bye bye